hey lovelies you are welcome back to the channel this is my first video for the year so happy new year to you all my name is Onyinyichi and you can call me Oni so if you're new here you are welcome for today's video we'll be making this oil this hair growth oil that we will be making today is a powerful hair growth oil because every ingredient is a hair growth agent mixed together to stimulate your hair follicle so let's jump in so here i have my jar and the first ingredient is black seed black seed oil is so potent and is also considered an essential oil due to its antifungal properties black seed is very good for hair growth for stimulating the scalp this black seed is also known as cumin i'm making this oil because i'm going to braid my hair so i'll be carrying the hair for like three weeks so i'll be braiding it with hair extension so i need an oil that i will constantly use to massage my scalp whenever i braid my hair the scalp is usually the target the next ingredient is fenugreek fenugreek will play the moisturizing role in this oil giving your hair strength and preventing breakage so i added 30 ml of the black seed and 30 ml of the fenugreek and now i will go in with my rosemary leaf uh, the rosemary you know smells amazing it improves blood circulation it in, it helps in hair growth where you are lacking hair and then experiencing hair loss rosemary is very good for hair growth the next i will go in with my olive oil which will act as a conditioning ingredient in this treatment it is also a lightweight moisturizing oil that is rich in vitamin a and k which is essential for hair growth so i'll be adding so i'll be adding 150 mils of that oil i used a bigger cup to measure that so olive oil is a good conditioner for hair and you can add up to 400 mils so next i will go in with my peppermint oil i will add eight drops of my peppermint oil to that this peppermint oil will help stimulate your scalp and aids blood circulation and it's very good for itchy scalp so when you are using this oil it is not something that you should wash out so next i'll be going in with my black castor oil this is homemade like i said this is homemade but you can use your black jamaican castor oil so i made this at home so i dropped two drops of that oil in the mixture and then our oil is complete our ingredient is complete i'll cover it i'm going to let this sit in a dark room for three months for three months away from direct sunlight this will help pull out all the beneficial natural oil from the dried ingredients i also ensure that i shake the oil once daily this oil will last for two years if stored properly away from dry from sunlight and heat so you should use it daily so at this point this is my oil as you can see look at the dust on the cover if you look at if you look at that container you would notice that i do forget to shake sometimes i forget i forgot completely to go and shake it because three months uh, is a long time more and it's hammer town here and there there are dust everywhere so that's why the cover is looking that dusty so i kept it in a cupboard and as you can see this is everything the oil it looks thick and the color is different um, and I think that's what I'm seeing so I've transferred into my wig cap and I'm going to strain the oil out I think um, the dried seeds absorbed most of the oil so I have decided that after straining this oil out I'm going to transfer everything back into the cup and add more oil and keep it so i will use the ones in the plate while i i i leave the oil to um, pull out more nutrients from 
those ingredients they are so precious i can't just throw them away please this is an ultimate routine for healthy hair it helps to prevent hair loss it helps to prevent dandruff so like i've braided my hair i'm going to be working this oil through my scalps daily i want to see results i want to see good results by the time i lose that hair so it's you can you don't have to carry natural hair all the time you can braid your hair but make sure you have an oil that you will use to moisturize your scalp to treat your scalp to make sure that your scalp is looking healthy so this oil will help keep my scalp shine and hydrated it will strengthen new strands that will be coming out it will help boost hair growth so um the next thing i'll do is that i'll transfer this oil into my storage container so this is what i will be using i do not have an applicator bottle so this is what i use and then i use a dropper to pick the oil and apply it to my scalp guys like i told you all my hair is transitioning from relaxed hair to natural hair so i have refused to do the big chop <laughs> so you can imagine what my hair looks like so I'm going to show you presently what my hair looks like when I'm done with this. The first set of pictures you saw at the beginning of this um, video, um, um, that's what my hair looks like when I started transitioning. That was my hair when I started transitioning. So I'm going to show you what my hair looks like currently. So today I plan to wash my hair and um, i lost a cornrow and my hair tangled badly so first of all i pre pulled and detangled my hair so here i am detangling for the second time because if i just walk in go in with my comb it will really really damage my hair because the hair really tangled hamatan and all with all my oiling and everything my hair still tangled if you look at it closely you see how i'm walking my hand through trying to be careful so that i will not damage my hair so your hair taking care of your hair is very important it is very important that you handle your hair with care you pamper your hair so i learned this when i started taking care of my hair myself when i stopped leaving my hair to hairstylists to handle the way they want some hairstylists do not even know how to handle hair properly especially here in nigeria so my hair stopped cutting anyhow i do not have big chunks of hair when i comb my hair so as you as you can see i do this before i start combing my hair i detangle my hair properly so first of all you have to cut your hair into section and then you go in with your hand and detangle your hair properly when you're going in with your comb it will be less painful less stressful and you will enjoy your hair and you will not break your hair at all so this is it i will do this all over my hair detangle one after the other and when i'm done i will wash my hair and show you what my hair looks like so guys at this point i have washed my hair and this is what it looks like as you can see this is my shrinkage you can compare this to the pictures you saw at the beginning of this video as you can tell that obviously this hair is really transitioning so you can see how easy it is for me to comb this hair because of the detangling i did initially i still go in to do little detangling when i'm combing i still touch places or the other my hair has not fully transitioned if you look at it you still see parts of it that are damaged so i give it a trim anytime i lose my hair i try to trim it but not completely so i let it and i still let it fall uh, on its own but my hair is not falling because i started giving it natural treatment so this is what my hair looks like at this stage this is my um 
progress so far this is what i've been able to achieve fuller hair healthier hair hair that is not falling anyhow so guys you can transition from relaxed hair to natural hair without the big chop who said you cannot do that i did not big chop my hair i just trim whenever necessary and this is what i have this is my shrinkage this is the type of hair that i have i am so happy with the result that i have at this moment so guys the oil we just made is a must have you have to make it for yourself and use it for your hair i have made mine and i am going to use it for my hair if you cannot leave it for three months you can leave it for a month and you can leave it for two weeks so if you have watched to this point thank you thank you thank you so much for watching please give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment please try this oil if you do please come back and tell me and if you have good results do not forget to share thank you thank you for watching see you in my next one bye